Nine million Americans served during the period of the Vietnam War. They represented 10% of their generation. Six million of them were volunteers. They were the oldest and best educated force America ever sent into harm's way. 97% would be honorably discharged. And today, the vast majority of them testify with their actions and their words that they are proud of their service and would serve again if called. November 14, 1965, 10.48 a.m. Elements of the 7th Cavalry touched down at Landing Zone X-Ray. Within 30 minutes, the Battle of the Idrang began, the first major battle fought by the American Army in Vietnam. Over three harrowing days, vastly outnumbered American forces would hold out and ultimately repel enemy forces. American forces would never lose a major engagement during the ensuing eight years of combat operations. Known as the Wall, the Vietnam Memorial stands in honor of those who served in the Vietnam War. The names of the men and women who gave their lives are inscribed in the order they were taken from us. 58,286 names. The youngest was Marine Private First Class Dan Bullock at 15 years of age, and the oldest was Navy Petty Officer First Class Kenna Taylor at 62. There are three sets of fathers and sons, one set of stepbrothers, 39 pairs of brothers, eight women, 16 clergy, and 155 Medal of Honor recipients. And let us not forget, there are still more than 1,600 missing and unaccounted for personnel. The French were in Vietnam before the Americans and lost more than 70,000 lives. More than 400,000 Allied troops served with the American forces. Joining as allies with the United States were the Republic of Korea, Thailand, the Republic of the Philippines, Australia, and New Zealand. These allies suffered more than 5,000 lives lost during the course of the war. American combat forces left Vietnam in 1973. Two years later, Saigon fell. Over those last two years, without American and Allied combat forces in the region, casualties in Southeast Asia were doubled what they had been during the 10 years prior. To our Vietnam veterans who answered the nation's call to serve, we thank you. Your greatness is etched in history from the battlefields of Southeast Asia to the neighborhoods of hometown America, where you continue to bring blessings and inspiration to your families and your country today. To the families of our Vietnam veterans, we thank you for the greatness of your support, sacrifice, vigilance, and compassion. And to our allies, who stood by us 50 years ago, we thank you. The greatness that was earned by this generation never left you, and it never will.